morning guys it's Ashley with Pugs and Pearls and it is Saturday and I'm super excited my dad loaned me his truck today so I'm actually gonna take it out to an old horse farm where I used to ride um, I have been so passionate about horses throughout my life I've ridden for about 13 years um, but when I kind of went away to college and then you know grew up and became an adult <laughs> I don't get to do it anymore um, it's expensive and it's a lot of time and those are things I don't have either one of so <laughs> Um, I'm so excited because my really, really good friend Lauren, who um, I actually met her doing horses, and she lives in Alabama, and Lillian, Alabama is actually where this farm is, and it's about 30 minutes um, from my hometown, so it's really not far, actually. Pensacola is like 35 minutes from Alabama, basically, so we're going to head into Alabama today, and I'm so excited to see Lauren. I haven't seen her in years and she's got a new horse So hopefully we'll get to see her new horse and see what she's been up to and um, I'm waiting in the Starbucks line right now because It's taking forever and I think Pensacola's Starbucks just take forever <laughs> So that's the difference between Tampa and Pensacola. Pensacola's a little bit slower um, Someone in the comments I saw thank you guys so much um, for liking the vlogs And I'm, I'm glad you guys do if you like them I will continue to do some you know here and there not all the time, but here and there and um, yes Pensacola is a good place to visit somebody mentioned that too um, it is definitely a quiet beach town it's not huge like Panama City or um, like Clearwater or anything like that it's definitely a slower paced town but that's because it's got a lot of ordinances in it to not allow it to grow too big so it's a very quiet very family oriented place um, definitely a good little beach visit for like a weekend or a couple of days but oh the line is moving here we go so guys, I am gassing up the truck and um, it's Labor Day weekend so Lauren said she was experiencing some traffic which does not surprise me. Um, everybody's probably going to the beach. So Starbucks kind of messed up my order. I um, had gotten an iced vanilla latte but they gave me a hot one but I need the coffee so I'm going to drink it anyway but I was going to send it back but then the line took so long because they're starting to use chip cards there and we've been using chip cards in Tampa for about two months now so they've figured it out but Pensacola is struggling <laughs> the Pensacola Starbucks is struggling <laughs> with their chip cards um, it's just taking forever for them to process so I don't know if you guys have experienced that where you are if you have chip cards yet but it's supposed to be a higher security feature on your card but frankly it just takes forever and um, some businesses are getting higher internet speed to compensate and I think that's what's gonna have to happen but it's just a pain in the butt. Alrighty guys, we're almost there. Mama's horse. Yeah. And what is Mama showing? Uh, he does the western. You doing western, boo boo? Yes. I don't understand the English. Yeah. The when English. I start posting, he's like, oh my gosh, she's gonna fall off. <laughs> I'm like, no. And those little hobbles are just for him to stay still, and they train them to be that way. I've never seen a horse that was hobble trained. It's pretty cool. It's pretty amazing. I have to admit, because it like it keeps him focused. It keeps him still. So he knows 
that like he's about to go to work. Yeah, it's pretty cool. Get this little tubby. Tubby, tubby you're so cute. Honey. Oh my goodness. Oh, that is so adorable. Does she show these? No. Hi. Hi. Oh my god. Tried to let little kids ride him one time and that didn't work. Oh, out so he's nice. still breeding too? Um, this one is a borders baby. Oh. They hey, bred baby. it inside of this bud over here. And then the mama's inside. Oh, so cool. Um, that's the only stud they have anymore. Well, one of them is a stud, but They're cruising. Oh, don't be afraid of me, boo boo. Get a little bath, boo boo. I bet that feels good. Trying to eat the little brushes, huh? Yeah, I see you. I see you there. So guys, that was so much fun going to the barn and getting to see Lauren and getting to see all of those horses, some which I remember from pretty much growing up in my childhood there. Uh, really getting to see them was something special. I didn't know that a lot of those horses were still alive, which is so exciting and um, just brings back so many good memories there with Lauren and riding and showing and all that kind of good stuff so she let me ride her horse BJ and that was really fun so I'll definitely show you a picture of BJ I think I took some video of him as well and Lauren riding so I'll show you guys that it was so much fun and the mini ponies oh my gosh you guys know I love mini polish I love mini makeup or miniature makeup and believe me I was so attracted to those little mini horses I had not seen them at that farm that particular farm before so it was so exciting to see them and trust me, someday in the future, if I can get my farm, get my horses, get my chickens, there will definitely be one, if not two, little mini ponies roaming around. So, too cute. I just wanted to squeeze them. They were so adorable. Um, but it was a lot of fun. Lauren's been up to some exciting things, some of which may be featured on this channel in the future. We're going to see. She's got to check into some regulations and stuff. And if it works, maybe she'll be on the channel too. Um, so you guys can see a little bit more of her. But it was so much fun and even heading down there when I turned into the farm, there was this huge snake crawling across the country dirt road. I tried to get it on film but it just went by too quickly but he was a big guy. So that was a little scary. I haven't seen a big snake in a long time. <laughs> but it was so much fun. I enjoyed myself. I got to ride which I haven't done in years. So enjoyable. And then tonight I'm going to be hanging out with some high school friends which I haven't seen in years as well. So that's really exciting too. and. We're going to, I think, a sushi place, so that'll be fun, and that's what's going on. So I hope you guys enjoyed. Thanks so much. So I'm at my boyfriend's mom's house, and this is their little dog, Buddy. Buddy is a what? A wiener dog? A Jack Russell wiener. He's a Jack Russell wiener, and he just warmed up to me. He would not talk to me earlier, so now he's he's all good now. He needs 10 minutes to make sure you're not a threat. Yeah, he's so cute. He looks full wiener to me. I don't really see... Or dachshund. Hey. Come on, Pearl. Run it out. Woohoo! Look at her go. Woo, 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 woo. Now she doesn't have the high grass. Oh, yeah, they cut it today. Taking the dogs out for their evening jaunt. They have so enjoyed this yard. Oh no. He's ready to like, oh, I just want to lay in the grass. Leave me alone. She's like, I'm not going to leave you alone. Get him, Pearl. <laughs> Dutchie, you're just loving it. You're just loving it. <laughs> He's got. Oh, there he goes. <laughs> so
So guys, we're back in the car. We are about three and a half hours into the trip. The little pugs are in the back. They're doing pretty good. Pearl's still crying a little bit, but she's getting a little better, aren't you? You're getting used to it. Um, we had such a great day yesterday, uh, which was um, Saturday. We saw some of our friends from high school, which we hadn't seen in a couple of years, and we got to see some of their new wives and kids, and it was just so exciting to see everybody, and everybody's doing really well. Um, it's it's kind of sad to leave a little bit because we've had such a good time catching up with old friends and our families. Um, but we are on the road again. We're actually at Taco Bell. We did a quick um, little drop for the dogs so that they could get out and walk. And now we are headed back. So we're kind of ending our vlog trip. Um, but it's been a lot of fun. Thank you guys so much for watching and I hope you've enjoyed.